After having three children, Catherine G tried everything to get back to her physical shape before her pregnancies. When I was considering my different options, the first one I mentioned was uh, physical therapy, so I did that, checked that box, and then I started talking to a bunch of different doctors and um, spoke to quite a few plastic surgeons to see if there was anything that they could do, and they all recommended the tummy tuck procedure, which involves a very large scar. Like 60% of women who have children, Catherine G suffered from diastasis recti, which is when the abdominal muscles separate after birthing children. Physical therapy can help, but for some, it's not enough. My core just wasn't as tight as I was used to, obviously after three pregnancies, but um, I could notice a physical difference. Um, and then the lower back pain was also just because of the lack of muscle in the abdomen area. With physical activity being such a large part of Catherine's life and mental health, she searched far and wide for an answer, even consulting various surgeons as far as California. After a long search, Catherine found Dr. John Abicolin, who suggested a robotic diastasis recti repair surgery. We're doing an operation staying outside of the abdomen, but getting just on top of the muscle with the camera and those instruments. A robotic surgery doesn't mean that a robot is conducting the procedure. Instead, what's happening is, is I'm sitting at a console a few feet from the operating table, controlling these very agile instruments and controlling the camera. And it allows me to do a very detailed, delicate surgery. With such a minimal scar and quick recovery time, both Catherine G and Dr. Abi Khalid encourage other women to explore the option of robotic surgery. Full recovery was about six weeks, so not too bad. Um, but after about a week or so, I was pretty back to normal. Since Catherine received the surgery, she's already been skiing in Colorado, biking, fishing, and staying as active as she was before her family grew.